and welcome. Welcome to Max of Tears. Today we're gonna to be talking about body Resident Evil 4. A lot of y'all say that Leon S. Kennedy's jacket is big and fluffy. I like the new jacket. A lot of people like it's too skin tight. So let me show y'all how y'all go do this. So y'all gonna go on Google. All right. First thing you're gonna to need to do is download Winmore, which actually, if y'all wanna follow along, just skip ahead. I got these timestamps and I also got these little notes. So you go download Winmore. Uh, I'll put the link in the description where I got mine from. Then after you go to download Winmore, you're gonna to go to Nexus Mods, right? And you're gonna find a thing called Fluffy Manager 5000. I also have the link for that too. So you know, should make things nice and easy for y'all. I'm gonna go hit manual download. I choose slow download, I ain't paying for this. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I probably would pay for it, but I'm just cheap, so you know what I'm saying? Hit download, you're gonna see it right here. So say Fluffy Mod Manager Zip. All right, cool. Oop. And then what we're gonna do is, minimize this for right now. Now we're going to go ahead and extract the Mod Manager onto the deck right here. All right, so I'm gonna drag it over, right? Very important, move it to the desktop. And then I'm gonna minimize it. And I'm going to hit extract here. Okay, you see all these folders popped up, right? Cool. So then I'm gonna hit this this there's two things you need to do. So what I do is I just hit pin right here, right click that, pin to the taskbar, pop that way I can just click and open it. We go open it up. Okay, y'all see all these games right here. Um for people that already have done this like 20 times and you've seen like a lot of times your game will not work for whatever reason, you want to make sure you update it. So you can go to like downloads, you know, things like that. Get it working. So choose a game. Looking for it. Hold on, where's Red Team Four? Hold on, yeah. That's HD. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Okay. So I'm updating it. There we go. I have to update. I guess it did install, but that's how you update it basically if it gives you any trouble. Which I do this ever so often. There we go. Added categories for Resident Evil 4 remake. Um, he, the person who created this, I'll definitely link him. He's really good at uh, updating it. So choose game. And before y'all start this, you download at your own risk. So don't come to me like, oh my my PC broke. Don't do that. All right, so we'll choose game over here. Okay. So a lot of y'all may be wondering why I decided to start the game first. I don't have any mods installed, obviously. But you want to make sure that the mod manager can locate the game. Because a lot of times when I'm playing games and the mod manager can't locate the actual game itself, right? So what we're going to do from here. Set my settings up. That's good. Okay. I can see it. I've been using the mod, this mod manager for a minute. As y'all can see, I got, you know, bare bones, Leon, right? Don't nobody want to play bare bones, Leon, with the baggy jacket. <laughs> Too huge. Stutter completely removed. Still look gorgeous to me. Well, never mind. Get my stutter in way. Okay, so I'm gonna quit. Uh, see if I can see. Y'all yeah, see what it is, dude. I'm gonna go ahead and get fired. So quit the game. Next on my little list. that joint uh, okay so now that we've done that I'm going to do now so now we've done that we get back on track so we're going to go we made sure that the mob edge is updated to the latest version which y'all see I couldn't find it at first uh, we opened the game before we turn to install any mods now we need to find the mod we're going to use for this one I'm going to keep it simple I'm just going to go for the uh, original 2005 game suit Y'all can see the little picture here. Let's do it. 
I mean, but y'all want that skin tight jacket, you know what I'm saying? So, I'm gonna go ahead and hit download on this. So you're gonna go to files, manual download. And you're gonna hit slow download just like before. There we go, cool. It's my favorite part, y'all. Hold on, that took forever, whatever. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna do so. Gonna open up the mod manager, right? Make sure you have the game that you want. It's actually selected, right? And then what you're gonna do. Okay. See, I said no mods found. Watch this. So you're gonna take the download, drag it all the way over into the interface. Drag and drop. And then you're gonna click the interface. You see that right there? See, I say Leon from the original? Cool. We're gonna see that picture. It sometimes has a picture, sometimes it doesn't, whatever. Click on click that. When it turns blue, see how it says right here, copy the files and style Leon original suit. This is the most important part. Once we install it, you then have to test it out. Uh, so it didn't say anything about conflicts. We don't have any other mods installed right now. But if you have two of the same costume, they share the same spot where it installs, you might have a conflict, but it'll let you know that. That's why another reason I love this mod manager so much. We're going to launch the game. Let's <laughs> increase the game. Yep. Voila, look at that. Skin tight, original RE4 Leon. So skin tight, even his pockets look low res. So if y'all want a, a low res, skin tight Leon, there you go. Last but not least, before I close this game out, appreciate y'all so much for watching my video to its entirety. Try to keep it short and sweet. Um, something else, if you want to uninstall a mod, so go back into the fluffy mod manager, right? And it, it makes it so easy. You just go click this little button, pop. Install. Start the game back up. Last done. Uh, that is it. That's Ms. Basketeers RE4 remake video. Comment, like, share, subscribe with your boy. Until next time.